welcome in a new video. So again, this is my bare face. I have no foundation on, no concealer on, no powder on. This is just pure natural, okay? And a few months ago, God, it wasn't like that. It was completely opposite. My skin was full of acne, full of closed pores, and it was just nasty, and I didn't know what to do with it because I was just so tired of fighting with acne and using these tons and tons of products that never actually worked. And finally, I found out about the originary products, and I was just like, you know what? Let me give a try. They are cheap anyway, so maybe this will help. Obviously, educating in the originary products is just like a hard math because it is really really complicated to understand what these weird names means and those percentages and all of those stuff it is overwhelming but believe me it is worth it it is worth it big time the ordinary products has changed my skin and within changing my skin it changed the way I feel about myself and I am much more confident right now and I have no problem with going without makeup anywhere anywhere even to school or to a public places or to a discotheque or discotheque anyone even say discotheque anymore to a club you know obviously now it's a lockdown so i'm not going anywhere but if there would be a possibility i would and this is all thanks to those babies i love them they are just my babies <laughs> and they changed my skin completely so I did a very similar video about my skincare journey with the ordinary products a few months ago although it was a very early stage of my journey let's say so now you guys ask me for an update so here it is a skincare update so I started using the ordinary products about five months ago and the first product I bought was um, niacinamide which is a game changer. It is a huge game changer. This is nice in my 10% plus zinc 1%. And I'm using this product every second day in the morning. After I clean my face, I put the toner on, I am applying this, and then I'm putting a moisturizer and the SPF on top. And believe me, like you can see, I don't have much anymore and I'll have to purchase a new one, but it wasn't expensive anyway, so it is fine. And this is the biggest advantage of using the ordinary product, that not only those products are fantastic and they really work, but they are also so affordable. So each one of us, even me, a broke student, can afford this bunch of different assets and products to put on my skin, which, which is just amazing. And I am forever grateful to this brand to finally implementing the skincare that worked and is affordable and is just great and fantastic and it has beautiful packaging and everything and everything. Although I know that the guy who actually invented all of those products is that and no one really knows what happens and now the company is owned by Estee Lauder which literally suck although I love these products and I don't want to stop using it so I'm kind of trapped right now anyway um, the second product that I'm using also every second day so I'm changing either niacinamide or this hyaluronic acid 2% plus B5 and this is relatively new product that I implemented to my skincare because I got it for my birthday from my best friend thank you because you know this is like the best gift you can give to me um, so hyaluronic acids are not only good for you know breakouts in your skin and everything but also they prevent aging which is highly needed okay because this girl is gonna be 25 next year and you know we need to stay taking care of the aging because I don't want to get old too fast the other game changer is a retinol and I'm using the retinol 0.5% in squal squalence, whatever the squalence means. I'm using that one and I am really really happy from the results. As I said in a previous video, I used to use that different retinol with a much higher percentage before and my skin got so bad. It was actually I think like the worst stage of my skin. Um, in the last like years because the percentage was too high and my skin wasn't used to it so it damaged my skin instead of um, helping so I reduced the percentage to a 0.5 and I am really really happy although this product is very strong and you really need to be careful and I'm using those every third 
every second, every third, every fourth. It really depends, but at least two times a week I'm using um, this product. And of course, after I clean my face in the evening, I put the toner on, I'm applying the retinol, and then on top of that, I'm applying this beautiful 100% organic cold pressed rose hip oil, which apparently has a lot of good stuff and it helps with moisturizing your face. So. I'm using that but this is definitely not essential this is just you know an extra I purchased for myself but speaking about this retinol because this is something that we all should have because this guy is not only helping to remove the acne all the breakouts all the scars but also it slows the aging process so believe me if you use it right this will be the best spent eight or ten pounds in your entire life I I love it the other product that I really really love is the salicylic acid mask and you don't have to use a mask. I'm using a mask only because they didn't have the serum anymore, they ran out of it and the serum apparently is like nowhere to be found anymore um, because everyone wanted it so badly but the lady said that I can use the mask instead. I'm not using this mask every single day because it is very strong and I don't want to damage my face so I'm using it once to twice a week every time I'm going to have a long bath I'm just putting this on my face and I'm just chilling and relaxing. Um, the color of it is horrible, it is black and I don't like it because after I apply it all my hands are black and all of my sink and the bathtub so it's definitely not ideal but it is really good for your acne and it's really good for your skin so there are three vitamins you should use on your face daily and it is vitamin A, vitamin B and vitamin C and vitamin A is basically all the retinol retinoids such as this one I showed you and then vitamin B it is niacinamide and then vitamin C which helps with brightening your face and make your face beautiful and glowy. I use vitamin C from a different brand that's why I didn't show it um, here but as you can see it is very easy vitamin A, vitamin B, vitamin C, vitamin A aka retinol, niacinamides and vitamin C. Easy as that. And the next products I have is this Squalen cleanser and also it is a gift from my friend and I am really happy although this is definitely not the cleanser I'm using on a daily basis because I prefer my good old CeraVe or Cetaphil although because the packaging is really small it is very convenient to take with you um, during your travels or whatever you want to go and you just don't want to have this huge um, package um, this is really good I don't see uh, major results after using this one although it is a good cleanser that's what can I say and the last products that I also really like but I just gave it to my mom to try it is a moisturizer with hyaluronic acids and this is also a very good cream I mean for me for me it is really similar to the CeraVe with hyaluronic acids you know using a hyaluronic acid is good it is a good moisturizer so if you are searching for something affordable I will highly recommend that one that one doesn't contain any SPF so if you're planning to use it in the morning don't forget to use an SPF on top in general using an SPF it is very very important um, someone mentioned that actually the where, are, where is it the niacinamide after using niacinamide apparently you don't need to use a sunscreen but after a retinols or hyaluronic acids vitamin C or any other acid using SPF is crucial because it can really damage your skin and none of us want to have a skin with a sun damage because it is not cute and it actually happened to me like I went on holiday a few weeks ago and there was a one day that I just got so stressed because of all of those things that was happening in the world and I didn't know if I would come back or no so that day particularly I forgot to use the sunscreen and oh, and because it was so hot and my skin was on the sun almost all day um, I woke up the next day and my skin was just very bad I mean it wasn't as tragic as it was before but it wasn't clear it definitely wasn't clear like I got a lot of acne and a lot of blackheads so it took me a good week to come back to my regular stage. In the end of the day I highly recommend using the original products. The price comparing to how good they are is literally unbelievable. Of course you can get hyaluronic acids and niacinamides and retinols and all of this stuff from a different brands but if you want to go for a good and safe brand those products are gonna be at least double the price which I don't really believe. I mean okay they might have some 
extras in it so it's not gonna be just a niacinamide or just the hyaluronic acid it might be a retinol with hyaluronic acid and with a shea butter and with something else on top so if you're willing to spend more money but don't really care about any research and just go for a good safe brand go for it but if you want to save some money I will highly recommend to just spend some time doing the research in what particular products works for you and believe me it is magic I uh, like look at my skin isn't it isn't it beautiful <laughs> I know that for many people this it is weird what I'm doing but for someone who was struggling with acne during literally my whole teenage year and my early 20s um, figure it out that these few products which are maybe seven pound each clear my skin from like this horrible stage to this one it is it is incredible and I I love it <laughs> I literally love it so I hope you guys enjoy this update if you want to know all the details about each one of the product don't forget to check my previous video because on that video I'm actually talking much more about each specific product and what it worked for and blah 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 on this one I was more focused on updating you guys how my journey is and it is beautiful okay and I'm not gonna give up on any of those products I'm not saying that I will use only the ordinary products forever because this is not true um, but I'm, I'm really happy that because of that products that because of they are so affordable I open myself to researching more and diving more into this skincare world which is really really interesting anyway thank you so much for watching of course all the links are gonna be down below if you have any question don't forget to leave them in the comment section down below and thank you so much for watching again if you like this video don't forget to leave the likes because it really helps with the algorithm and thank you for 250,000 views on my previous original video because it is it is just it is just mind-blowing and I am so grateful richly I'm so grateful um, so yeah thank you again and I will see you guys in the next one bye